sorry about that. Uh, didn't have enough storage, so I only have like eight something minutes to do this. But anyways, uh, Egyptian musk, uh, one of Athena's scents is musk, and they didn't have regular musk. Um, and this is not the one I had in mind. I had precious musk in mind, so I'm going to have to go to another store to get that. But uh, he said that this is more musky than the other one that they had. Then I got... Um, Orange Blossom, which is another one of hers. I think, yeah, Orange, yeah, Orange Blossom was another one, so I got that. I almost left without getting it, and then there, I saw this giant box, um, like, big box behind him, so got this. Um, and then Patchouli is another one, but they didn't just have flat-out patchouli, they had vanilla patchouli, and, um, I really haven't smelled any of these, you guys, so. What? Oh! That's kind of powdery and sweet, but, hmm, interesting. Yeah, so, and then he also gave me this incense that's a Indian temple incense. Holy shit. Um, that stuff I'm going to burn outside because I know that's going to last for like a month. I am not even going to try to smell this, you guys. I mean, I smelt it on the way here, and oh, it is rough. Um... It's just really, really strong. Anyways, coffin and all my incense actually fit in here, which is cool. So, another thing. Um, yeah, so I was looking for stones. I was looking for lapis. I was looking for uh, azurite, which was actually the one I was most focused on. Um, iolite, star sapphire, you know, things like that. Um, because I looked for where stones were. So, I asked the guy, I'm like, hey, do you have any lapis? Um, and I showed him my list. And he's like, yeah, I have this, 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 and that. So he brought out these pendants, and they're all kind of, like, gaudy and kind of big. You know, and they're pretty, but I didn't feel really drawn to them. You know, I was just like, oh, yeah, okay. You know, like, nothing was kind of, I didn't feel like I was impressed necessarily with many of them. And then um, he's on the other side of the, you know, the glass counter or glass case. And I, like, look over, and I see some more, and they're all pretty, you know, medium size to big size or whatever. And all of a sudden... I see this. Get it off my head. I don't even know if you guys will be able to see this. But, um, I see this guy. Sorry. I'm shaking. I don't really have steady hands, you guys, so. And I don't know if it's going to focus, but I see this thing. And it's, you know, relatively small. And I see it. And I'm like staring at it. Like, I can't stop looking at this thing. And I'm like, holy shit. Like, it just, I just kept looking at it, and I just felt like I knew. I felt that I had to get this. Um, I mean, there's something so just simple and just fitting about it, right? And I just felt like Athena, you know, like it just worked. And so, got it. And I was explaining to the shopkeeper, right, this whole thing with Athena, and I realized, like, all of a sudden, as I'm talking to him, right, these little squiggle marks, right? Snakes. Snakes. Right? Medusa, Gorgon, snakes. And I was like, holy crap. So definitely bought this. Now, another thing I wanted to get at the store, I had seen it multiple times before, and I always passed by it because I was like, oh, I can't afford it. But it, one in particular, I, I've been wanting to get a pendulum, right? One in particular, and um, I had thought that this one had... It was onyx, right? And onyx is one of my stones. I just feel like it is. It keeps me grounded. There's just something about it. I see it, and it's sturdy and heavy and just, you know, just... So I come back, and this same pendulum, even though they're having a sale, is still here. The same exact one. And I'm like, ooh, I'm gonna, I, I just knew that I was going to get it. So I asked the guy, but I spin the kind of the case thing around to show him. You know, it has like a little wheel thing that you push and whatever. I'm like, what is... This stone that's next to the rose quartz. And he was looking at another rose quartz with garnet. I'm like, no, 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 the dark one down below. Now, I had thought, again, that it was onyx. It wasn't. Um, what I was seeing was the black felt behind the stone. But it was kind of hard because it didn't seem very uh, translucent. So I was like, oh, okay. You know, okay. It's, it ended up being quartz. But here's the creepy thing. The gems around the top of the rim are iolite. Another, it's another one of Athena's stones. Iolite. 
around the rim of the thing. So I got this. And um, I picked it up. Oh, it's it's so cold, you guys. It it's just it's amazing. So I picked it up, and I just felt it, and I was like, ooh, like it just it's just gonna work. So uh, I bought it, and thank God they were having a sale. But um, is that from my hands? Ooh. But yeah, it's quartz with iolite around the top. And it's just probably going to take me a while just because I do not have steady hands at all. My fingers shake all the time. But um, yeah, so I bought a pendulum, you guys. So that's going to be cool for the new place. Thinking I'm going to use it tonight, maybe, probably, no, maybe within the next couple of days just because I know it needs to get in tune with me. So it knows me and I know it. But I just want to share that with you guys. Amazing stuff! Let's be.